So in this video, I'm going to talk about fixing shell ice. So shell ice is when you have an air pocket and what it does is it creates a bit of a void. So you can see here I've got solid ice here and then solid ice up here. So we had some kind of air pocket in here and there's about a, an inch difference between this and this, so that's what it takes to fix it. So all I'm gonna do is pack it up with snow. Spray it with some water. Got pretty deep holes here, so I'm using a lot more water than you would need if you had a normal sized hole and then more water. And then just using a puck to, to flatten it out. Is just to get it flat. If you have any if you have any bumps or ridges, then it's obviously going to freeze that way. So you're trying to avoid that. There. So I'll leave that now. It should freeze solid, and check it out in the morning. So it's the next day after I was fixing the shell ice in this area here it's hard to probably see but this is the area I fixed with the snow so it's very solid it's not chipping away like it was yesterday so I'm just going to put some hot water on it just to smooth it out it's quite cold so this will help Make it nice and smooth to skate on eventually. And you can see here the discoloring. It's a little bit more white, I would say, than the ice, but it's solid. So this is good. Be able to skate on it and it won't flake or chip away. The only thing is these holes here, where um, where the ice was chipping away, it was pretty deep. So you can see over here, it's not very smooth the the surface. So I'm gonna have to work to to smooth it all out. But the most important thing is that it's nice and solid. It's not gonna chip away. It's been about five or six days since my repair of the shell ice. So you can see it's a bit discolored here. So this is just the water that I filled up that froze. This is where I had the shell ice where it was all chipping out and I packed it with snow and then sprayed some cold water on it with a water bottle. So even though it's a bit discolored, it's just as hard as this. I actually took a few sharp turns through this section of the ice and it didn't chip at all. It reacted the same way as my hard ice does, so I would say it's successful. It's not as pretty as this, but it's very functional and it uh, isn't a safety hazard anymore. And you can see the the sharp see-through here, where there's no chunks of ice flying off or anything like that. So all in all, I would say it was a successful repair.